guys and welcome to this week's episode of We Are The Bonsai Supply. I am Jerome and today we're going to check out a local bonsai club. Alright, so I'm at the Flamingo Gardens right now in Davie, Florida and I'm checking out a, a local bonsai show by the Broward Bonsai Society. Let's go check it out. I've walked past this tree in Home Depot a hundred times. Mm -hmm. Sell them every couple of times a year. Tried it a couple of times, couldn't couldn't get it to grow. I don't know who this belongs to, but the refinement is incredible. Um, take away the flowers and what you got? Still got a pretty tree. tree. And and believe me, uh, they don't grow very fast. I think they're from New Zealand, right? Yeah. Yeah. New Zealand tea room. Yeah. And uh, I mean, the, the, it's an incredible tree. The, the, the contrast between the different colors of the flowers, is, it's like seeing one of those azaleas that have multiple color blooms on it. Really pretty. And, they, and, they, and the wood is uh, old looking too. It's really it's pretty. Beautiful. bonsai for a long time and learn uh, to appreciate a tree and you start appreciating the tree when the tree gets a dignity to it that when you stand in front of it you don't have to say anything you just need to look um, this is a clump style uh, coolie, coolie hat um, probably one of the best ones I've ever seen in, in bonsai, you don't see many. And you don't see them that old very often. But the tree has everything. It has little small leaves, varying in color. It has old branches that are moving, um, that that look old. They change direction. They they're tapering good. And then you got the flower that's in context with the the contra, context, excuse me, with the size of the leaf. <coughs> Um, normally the flower gets bigger and it gets, you know, it doesn't look right. But this, uh, this guy's really fun.
very, very typical of the species. It's, it's grown just like the, the, a lot of people think these trees are uh, inland trees. They grow on the shore in Brazil. And they, they have all kinds of different shapes and sizes. They don't always grow straight up. But when they do grow straight up, this is what they look like. Um, and you can see how the, the typical growth on these is start to flatten out. And, and uh, over the years, this branch will flatten more, this will flatten more. It'll get flatter all over the place. Sometimes it fights the, the one factor in bonsai that we always stress, and that's taper. Sometimes it flattens out to a point where it loses taper, but that's part of the trick. You just have to, just have to live with it. So, like we always say at Bonsai, sometimes you got to close your eyes. You, you, just, you, can't, you can't control everything. Really, really pretty tree. My name is Heidi and uh, I'm a member of the Broward Bonsai Society. We are a group of about roughly 30 members and uh, it's a great support system for people who want to learn about bonsai. And uh, we have a lot of fun and we help each other and, uh, and bonsai is a wonderful hobby it becomes a passion and uh, you are together with other people in a club and you share that passion with them and you become really family. Thank you.